Yeah, we're finally we're finally here. This is over a year in the making. You know, we started this project last year, and unfortunately, it didn't go so well. And and that's what's exciting about being back this year to get a second chance, and hopefully, we can safely do the jump today. Dude, Matto's rolling is huge. He starts way back there. He passes him at probably 70 or 80 miles an hour. And Levi starts after him and kisses him. I want to see which one goes further. A little nervous, man. It's been, uh, it's been a month since I've jumped this kind of setting. And, uh, you know, we've done a lot of speed tests over the last two days. And we've kind of had all kinds of different weather, you know. 400 feet on a dirt bike's a long ways. The fog is pretty gnarly right now. And I, I talked to Matto. And he's like, man, I don't know. <laughs> like, he's like, what's the cutoff point? And I, and like, I say, if we can see the landing from the jump, I'd say it's, at least we know where we're going then. <laughs> good. A little bit nervy, dude. Yeah. Good. More than good. At this point, both the boys have done all their training that they can do, so they're prepared, ready to hit this jump. Should be a good night. I actually just said that I love you, good luck, and that God gives you strength. Keep that baby straight. Keep her, keep her on that dotted line. I'm so, I'm so pumped. You said it was a soft landing. You looked like you knocked yourself out. <laughs> <laughs> I was built for hard landings. Tandem jump is definitely uh, a scary thing, you know. To know that I have Levi and all of uh, 600 pounds behind me, you know, it's uh, definitely a daunting feeling. I'm as excited as I think a person could be. I just safely landed an over 400 foot jump. You know, we, we made it this line. We're going to come back next time and go even further.